You hear some pretty big health claims being made about ionic foot baths, ranging from detox to weight loss, stress relief, improved digestion, and more. But do these things really work? Hi, I'm Sage. Thanks for joining me. I'm here to bring you cutting edge, actionable health information to put you in control of your health destiny. Please support us by hitting the subscribe button and ringing the notification bell. It doesn't cost you a penny and it does so much to support our tiny family business. I love supporting you on your health journey, not just with educational information, but also with the nutritional fuel to help you achieve your goals. You can find a link down in the description below to the world's healthiest gourmet chocolate, delicious elixir blends, and the purest, most potent adaptogenic herbs. Now, proponents of ionic foot baths will tell you that these are using positive and negative ions to draw out toxins from your body through your feet, and people will do these foot baths and see the water turn brown and think, oh my gosh, that was all inside me? Thank goodness I did this ionic foot bath and got all that crap out of my body. However, we have a problem here because what it happens if you don't put your feet in? Turn the machine on, sit down, and just watch it the water turns just as brown. To me, that is so scammy, so deceptive. The brown color that you're seeing here is generally resulting from impurities in the water and also sometimes things that these uh, facilities are actively adding to the water. These things are reacting with the ionization and creating that brown color color and funk that you see. And some of this is also possibly coming from corroded metal inside the ionization unit. None of this is doing anything for your health. Now, some people online will point to this study supposedly coming from a place called the Center for Research Strategies that said that they did blood tests on folks and looked at their heavy metal levels and they found that after using ionic foot baths for a period of time, they decreased their heavy metal levels by about half which would be cool if it was real and if the Center for Research Strategies actually existed and could produce this study. I've looked high and low. I've not been able to find this actual study. Just a lot of people that refer to it and make this claim based on this supposed study. I've not been able to find the Center for Research Strategies. That's like the most kind of generic and weird name that you could possibly come up with. I found a Center for Research Strategies. I don't know if it's the same one. It's a consulting business in Denver that according to Google is now closed. But the truth is there are so many things you can do out there to improve your health from diet to lifestyle, to supporting with adaptogenic herbs, taking different supplements, undergoing any number of different health enhancing therapies. The thing is that ionic foot baths are not on this list of things that are actually gonna be helping you. So. Spend your time and money on things that are actually going to be impactful because there's no shortage of those out there. And before you go, here's a link to a video that I think you would enjoy watching next. And here's another link to a video that YouTube thinks you would enjoy watching next. And there's a link to our website. Have a great day, guys, and look forward to seeing you again next time.